So let's talk about categories. Joomla articles can be categorized. It offers the possibility of creating as many categories as you wish and it is possible to build nested categories and one article can be related to one of these categories. And in one category you can put as much article as you want. So as an example, this is not a real newspaper, it is an example site from a template club from Joomla. And this is the example site World News and you see as in all newspaper sites you have here business and finance and below money and I don't know what and here for example are three layers here. So here you have home, FAQ and another layer. And, and another layer. <laughs> so, and it's possible to construct categories like this and put articles into these different layers. In Joomla's category manager, you can have as much categories as you want. And you see, if you, if you are here in the menu content, you have the article manager, the category manager and the featured articles. And when you go into this article manager, you have here a second level navigation where you can switch between your articles, your categories and the featured articles. And when you look at the categories, you see these nested structures. So above you have the sample data articles and below Joomla extensions, components, modules, for example. When we access an pre-made category like this components you see a category needs a title in this case components the alias is created by Joomla and it can have a parent item so in this case components is the child of extensions extensions is the child of Joomla and so on it it needs to be a state whether it is published or not and an access, whether it is the public registered or a special customer access level, you can set permissions, but we don't want to do that now. And you can set a language so that you can filter by languages. And you have, of course, a description here. And in the example data, they insert an image here in front of the component. So this is possible by using the editor, but it's also possible to combine an image here in the basic options. So for example, you can select an image from the media manager and link it to your category. Okay, I will close this here. And when we now have a look at the site, and you click on using Joomla, using extensions, and here components, you have exactly the structure as we have seen in the administration. So this is using Joomla, using extensions, components. And when I go back into the administration, I see these categories here. But when I compare it to the website, this is a menu and here in the administration, these are categories. So there should be or must be a menu for that. And when I go to menus in the about Joomla menu, I see these using Joomla, using extensions. And when I have a look on the right side here on the menu type item, I see the different type items which are linked to the menu items. So for example, this component menu item is linked to the article category block. And we want to have a look into this menu item. And when I click here on the menu item select button, I see the different possibilities of menu items I can use. And for example, when I look in the category area, I see here the category block, the category list and the featured articles. So with the block, I can display article introductions. Article introductions are the part of the article 
and the category list is yeah simply a list of articles okay let's go back and have a look what is linked and you see here is a list of categories category articles and here components is a category block so let's have a look on the website and when I click here on the components this is a list of articles so there should be an article with the name content when I click on this content you see well this is the article and here it is in the category components and this layout type here in components is the same as in the front page so here you have one column and a few articles and when I go to the front page I have three columns but the idea is nearly the same so you have the piece of the article which is before the read more link and so on and when I compare this for example with a list this one is a list of other categories okay let's go back components was a list of articles in a category using extensions is a list of other categories so for example here you have the category using extensions and below you have components modules templates and as you assume there are plenty of possibilities to configure these things so here on the right side you can see category options the title the description and all these things and then below the block options so how does it look like leading articles intro articles and all these things and article options what should be shown so you have a lot of possibilities to configure what appears after someone clicks at this menu item and the other possibility is the list and a list you will get just a moment here in components and, and here is it an article category list so this for example is a list in a table and you can configure as well here what appears in this table and is it the link and what is the sort criteria and these things and here you have a good comparison between the block and the list layout when you click here the block layout you see this what looks like a front page and in the list layout yeah you have these list and the featured articles these are the articles from the front page so these are the three different menu item types where you can link to existing categories so the category system in Joomla 1.6 is very very powerful and quite easy to use you can easily structure your entire website by using a set of nested categories in a yeah, user-friendly way the only thing I noticed was only one article can be assigned to a category so it's not possible to have one article in different categories.